I'd then like to show you the different simulation options. So here we have the machine relief that I have created for this particular part. I'm just going to click simulate and it will open up this simulation window. Here I have the relief resolution for the actual simulation. So I'm just going to set it fast. Here you can see it simulates this quite fast but it also gives quite a rough finish. So if I just zoom in here, you can see it's not really the best finish on there. But if you're just looking for some idea of how the part's going to look once it's machined and you just want to save time, then this may be the simulation option for you. I'm just going to delete that simulation and I'll show you what it looks like using the standard simulation. As you can see, this will take just a little bit longer to produce the simulation because it's using up more memory. I'll just zoom in here, you can see it looks okay. So there's the standard simulation. I'll just delete that and I'm going to show you the high detail simulation. So this is going to give me quite a good finish. So here you can see it's just coming over this part. It will take a lot longer to produce the simulation because it's using a lot more memory to do this. As you can see it's quite a good finish on there. I'll just zoom in for instance here. Here you can see it's quite a good finish on the actual part and you can see where the cutter is going to leave marks on the piece as we're using a 3mm ball nose to cut this piece and you can see all the marks where the 3mm ball nose is going to go so I'll just zoom back out and it's just finishing the simulation So I'll just delete that, that's quite a good finish there and I'll select simulation again and I'll select custom and I can change this to whatever I like. Here you can see I've put 50 pixels per millimetre. As you can see though this also increases the memory quite a lot compared to for instance the high detail. So this is going to take quite a long time to machine. So I'm going to change it to let's say one pixel per millimeter. This will make it even faster than the fast resolution. So I'll simulate the toolpath. Although this will not give a very good finish it's just a very fast simulation. So I'll just simulate the toolpath. Now you can see how fast this is producing the simulation but it's giving an awful finish. Let's say for instance this particular part here I know that this is going to machine okay. What I'm particularly worried about is the inside here on the middle part of this so I'm going to delete this simulation I know that it's going to cut this fine so I'm going to switch on my vectors and I have rectangle here and I'm going to go back onto the simulation and I'm going to select high detail this time but instead of the whole model I'm going to simulate inside a vector so I'll simulate that and here you can see it's going to create a simulation quite fast until it hits this vector and then it's going to start giving me a high detail simulation So there we have a high detail simulation within a vector.